I'm Don Aaron with the Metropolitan Nashville Police Department. This is a video news release concerning an exchange of gunfire between a woman and a Metro police officer on Friday morning, March 12th. The officer was wounded and is hospitalized. The woman was fatally wounded and died at a local hospital. You are about to see body-worn and in-car camera footage so that you can have a better understanding of what occurred based on what we know up to now. The Tennessee Bureau of Investigation and this police department conduct thorough use of force investigations. This investigation is at the early stages and will take time to complete. A word of caution. The images and information you are about to see may be disturbing and difficult to watch. Viewer discretion is advised, especially for children and sensitive viewers. Just after 9.30 a.m., Field Training Officer Josh Baker from the East Precinct was patrolling in the area of Brick Church Pike and Ewing Drive when he spotted a black 2015 Chevrolet Camaro. Officer Baker was aware that the registered owner of the Camaro, convicted felon Demond Buchanan, had six outstanding drug warrants charging five felonies and one misdemeanor that were issued last month for possession of heroin, cocaine, methamphetamine, ecstasy, Xanax, and crack cocaine. Officer Baker radioed to check on the airborne status of a police helicopter, believing that the driver of the Camaro might try to flee. 23. 23. Two, Is there one still available? All right. The Camaro stopped in the parking lot of the Dollar General store. Officer Baker found that it was being driven not by the wanted drug felon, but by Nika Nicole Holbert. 23, everything's 10 4 right now. He's not in here. 10 4. You want me to give everyone a signal line? 10 4. While Ms. Holbert essentially complied with Officer Baker's directives during the first few minutes of their interaction, her compliance changed after Officer Baker found what appeared to be marijuana and a powder substance in her bag and attempted to detain her while waiting for backup officers. As you will see, Officer Baker drew his non-lethal taser in an effort to safely bring Ms. Holbert into custody. Officer Baker drew his service pistol when he saw that Ms. Holbert had pulled a gun. As he demanded that she put the gun down, Holbert shot Baker. He returned the fire. Just bring your bag out here. Okay. Ma'am, stop, stop going through it. You come step right back here. What did you take out of it? Nothing, I was Okay, okay, all right, listen. Just come back here. I think we're getting off on the wrong foot, okay? Because I'm really confused on why I'm getting stopped. He's got several warrants. Okay, I, that has nothing to do with me. You don't know who's in the car. Nobody's in my car. Well, now I know that. However, now I'm going to address the other problems. Okay, so you want so, my bag and all okay. my belongings. So just step right back here. Can I use the restroom? And let you know this being audio and video recorded. Just to let you know. Okay. 23. If you did have one more, that would be, that would be good. Right. 10 4, dispatch any unit near Ewing Drive and for church, Ewing Drive and for church. Can we step back here? 21 to 23, do you need to be code 3? Negative, just code 2. So it's just in here? Yes, sir. Okay, was there. Well, I'm about five minutes from me. This is? Church and Ewing. Church. 13, can I have you starting around? You're about four minutes away. Disregard, I'm, I'm actually, disregard on that. Can I get my lighter? 
Yeah, I'm not done with that though. Where's your lighter at? In the car. 13, it says you're about seven second. minutes away. I'll get, I'll get it for you in a second, okay? Uh, so you would drive oh, right there at door. the Dollar General. Can I have you start from okay. 23? You scared me. Thank you. Do me a favor, turn around. No, hold turn on, around. don't put me in handcuffs. I haven't done anything wrong. Ma'am. No, don't put me You're in about handcuffs. to get tased. No, 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 Get down. No, get down on the ground. Down on the ground. No, 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 no. I didn't do nothing. I didn't do nothing. Ah, 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 ah. Help me. Help. 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 Step out. Ma'am, put the gun down! Put the gun down! <laughs> 23 shots fired! Shots fired! 10 4, 13, keep at that code 3. <laughs> 23, I'm hit. Put the gun down! <laughs> 23 shots fired! Shots fired! 10 4, 13, keep at that code 3. <laughs> 23, I'm hit. Officer Baker was shot in the side of his torso. The round went under his bulletproof vest. Holbert tossed her semi-automatic pistol in the parking lot before fleeing in the Camaro. She drove for about a block before running off the road at the intersection of Brickchurch Pike and Moorwood Drive. Officers rendered aid for her gunshot wounds until an ambulance arrived. She died later Friday morning at a local hospital. Officer Baker is in stable condition after undergoing surgery. In the coming days, the Tennessee Bureau of Investigation and the Davidson County District Attorney's Office will continue to investigate and analyze this incident. By policy, the MNPD will also be conducting an administrative review of the tactics and interaction you have just seen to ensure that they meet the high standards expected of our officers. Thank you for watching this video news release.